Okay, what's up my fellow speedsters? It's Lord Speed. This is one day. Uh, it's not coming out exactly then, but this is one day after I uploaded the Corey S. Kenshin is Evil video. You what, mate? You what? Okay, so basically this entire video is just going to be me explaining um something. So on my old channel right before i deleted it i started this new series called let's not really call it anything it's like a truth video i just wear a beanie i wear a button up and i just say the most outlandish stupid stuff ever i literally said that we live in a simulation i like you man you lie a lot and the simulation started on my birthday i also said that in that same video i'm like world war ii didn't actually happen all this historical stuff didn't actually happen in the simulation and it was programmed into our brain okay And in the next one that I uploaded, I said aging is a disease caused by water, okay? And then my third one is Koya's Kenshin's Evil. And basically in the video, I'm saying that anybody associated with the color red is like hell related. And uh, screaming is like bringing about like a demon on this world and stuff. And people are were actually commenting. Like this is just one day after. So I can't see into the future of how um, the dislikes and the comments are going to be. I just wanted to say that if you watch that entire video and you see me saying demons and the color red is bad and screaming is bad and playing Five Nights at Freddy's is bad, you 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 can't read social cues. I'm I'm not not to be disrespectful, but I have a red and black gaming chair, okay? And my soundproofing's red and black, and I even, I even tried to make it easier to understand that I was joking, okay? I literally grabbed my controller that's red and black, and then guess what I also do? I grab my headphones that are red and black. I'm just like doubling down on the, like how much of an idiot I am during those videos. It's literally just a joke. And then I mentioned, I specifically mentioned Five Nights at Freddy's as a bad game for children because I literally uploaded Five Nights at Freddy's onto the channel. Interesting, interesting. And I, I have to, Freddy, whoa. Oh. All you need to do is scroll down. I don't even have that many videos on my channel. All you have to do is scroll down and see that I played Five Nights at Freddy's on my channel already, okay? And this is the thing, I'm like, um, I'm giving crap to Corey for uh, playing horror games and playing games about ghosts. I already played them, it, it, it's so stupid. I'm giving him crap for wearing red and then people think I'm being serious. I don't know, like, it was just literally a joke and this is the only time I'm gonna do this. So the videos where I'm wearing a black button up and a beanie, don't take what I'm saying too seriously. I'm just oh, that's a like, people need to learn how to take a joke. I, I don't know, like, people, and it's crazy. Like, people are coming at me for judge, judging Corey, okay? My favorite YouTuber. Um, I literally said that in my first video on this channel. But people were, like, judging me, right? And... Like, they're, okay, so they're getting mad at me for judging Corey, but that's exactly what they're doing back to me, okay? So, uh, let's read some of these comments. So, some of these comments, I basically, uh, this dude, JC, I think, um, he probably was just, like, watching the video and just, like, went down and commented each time he saw something he didn't like. <laughs> so, um, I'm gonna read my pinned comment at, uh, at the end, uh, as, cause I have other stuff to say besides these comments, okay? Uh, so, let me go in here, sort by... We have to go to newest first to see that that really because that, that guy really hit me there like he really shut up bro like oh my god saying shut up to a video really makes the video stop playing I am the one, the way your time don't need the okay so this dude jc said he'd be telling kids that are scared to click off the video because uh basically i was saying that uh Corey's like after children like after your children and stuff because it was just a joke because there was literally a video this guy called I exposed the MCs. A year ago, he made a video saying that Corey was like evil and satanic and stuff and that he's like a fake Christian uh, just because he wears a red shirt and plays horror games. He said real Christians wouldn't play that kind of stuff. I was just doubling down. It's literally a parody of that video that Corey mentioned himself and was laughing about. And then people are like over here crying about it. So he'd be telling kids that are scared to click off the video. That's nice. He literally be grabbing his cross when he's he, she a demon and FNAF demon. I've never seen a Five Nights at Freddy's demon, okay? <laughs> I don't know what he's talking about. I, I'm pretty, like, I know what he's talking about. I'm just clowning with you. Like, I don't take the internet seriously because it's all just, it's all just typed up words and it's not actually things that would actually happen in real life. 
Would I wear a beanie and a button up and say this outlandish stuff in real life? No, because I don't want to look like an idiot in real life. You know what I'm saying? This is all just for entertainment purposes, just to be funny, like other YouTubers. And then people were just, like, this one guy was trying to insinuate that I wasn't acting like myself and I was just trying to view farm. <laughs> I'm literally acting like myself, like I'm just being an idiot. I just like to say stupid stuff. It's funny to me to say stupid stuff to make people believe that I'm actually an idiot because I don't believe that we live in a simulation and I don't believe that aging is a disease caused by water. I have more outlandish videos exactly like this that I believe is worse than just Koya Koya's Kenshin evil. Like if you don't, like this is the thing, you see the video Koya's Kenshin's evil and then you click into it to watch. Like I literally, um, this video has 68 views so this is my most viewed video on this channel because I was getting more views on the other channel uh, for a time. I beg your pardon. I beg your pardon. But uh, let's keep reading these comments. Okay, so the guy says his favorite color is actually blue and and black. Uh, wait, no, blue and black. Red is the most common shirt color. Um, this is the most common shirt color in my closet. And he said his most favorite color is blue and black. Um, I actually didn't know that. But I didn't really, I never really said anything about his favorite color. I literally just brought up that he wore a red shirt. Uh, I didn't never said that his favorite color was red. Um, okay, so let's read Blossom. Man, I just want everything to go back to normal. Like, for somehow, Koya's Kenshin got some hate. Please comment what happened or why they hate or something like that. All I know is Koya's Kenshin is our, is our real ankle breaker. Apparently... And apparently you're hating on him because his favorite color is red. My sister likes red. My friend likes red. He plays horror games because he is the bravest person I've seen on YouTube. And bravest person? You never watched Coyote Peterson? Okay. Um, I've seen on this YouTube and Markiplier. LOL. Just stop. Red is a good color. It doesn't mean hell or bad stuff. You have red everywhere. This, this dude gets it. Okay. So he sees that I have red, right? He sees that I have red all around me. I'm literally wearing a red shirt right now. He sees all this stuff and he still thinks I'm serious. He still took this time to write this essay. I'm literally in his mind rent free. I know he's still thinking about me a day later. He's literally typing up this entire thing. It's, it's supposed to be ironic that I'm coming at somebody for wearing red when everything I have in my setup is red, okay? My profile picture used to be the Black Flash. Guess what colors he is? Red and black. Like, bro, it, it's, it's funny. I'm not even mad. I'm not even mad because it's just funny. This is the reaction that I wanted. I wanted people to type up and try to make me look like an idiot because that's what I, I'm portraying myself as. And the thing is, these people, like, there's uh, more comments, like, uh, a few more, actually. And um, the guy's kind of, like, judging me, and he never watched any of my other videos to see how I actually am. Like, he said to, like, just be yourself. Like, that was, I only have three. I have 21 videos up right now while I'm recording this. Only three of the videos that I have on my channel is me with the beanie talking about weird stuff. And literally, that's me. I'm creating it. It's just a front. You know, it's just a joke. It's just, uh, um, um, oh my God, my brain just, my brain just collapsed in on itself. No, it's just a, a video long joke. Like it's just supposed to be a fun series to watch. I thought people would watch this and know that I was joking, but I don't, I'm pretty sure. Um, I don't know what's going on because even me reading this, like my, my brain is like trying to auto correct the comments because um the the type like the spelling the everything's not there bro um where was i oh uh, you have read everywhere so then so then you match hell then i match hell i match hell i match hell then okay and then he says so me i yell when i get scared yes i don't care and i yell at the top of my lungs red is also from a rainbow color yeah rainbow doesn't mean hell bad devil come on give Corey's kenshin a second chance if you don't like him I'm not going to, I'm not going to give me a second chance. That sounds like a skill issue. Uh, but he says, cause I will always like him and you guys ruined my good relationship with Corey S. Kenshin on YouTube. You made him leave. Um, I'm just going to say I did not make Corey S. Kenshin leave YouTube. He left uh, way before I recorded this video and way before I even posted it. Okay. Um, Corey left because he wanted to. Get the hell out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Okay. Get out. Get out. Like, 
that it has nothing to do with me. Corey literally, I okay, this video is a direct parody of a video that Corey already talked about. He already mentioned it and laughed at it. Do you think somebody would leave a platform, an entire platform, just be uh, over a video that they found like hilarious? Like Corey laughed at that video because the video is stupid. The guy is saying it's exposed to MCs. He's literally saying that Corey's satanic all this stuff, not a real Christian. He and he also says that like Corey's a different person. I think that's another video. But Corey thinks Corey thought it was funny because it's outlandish. It's not like it's stupid. No one believes it. But let's keep going. Uh oh yeah. So that was the end of that guy's video uh comment or he or she. But um supposedly it's people like me that made Corey leave the platform, okay? Um me saying that Corey screaming and being a, a skinwalker, uh, bringing about something of this world made him leave YouTube. I really made him, like, he thinks about me before he goes to sleep. Corey definitely cares. <laughs> um, okay, so this guy named Pusha G, stop playing with the Shogun like that. He doesn't care, okay? It, it's just a joke. Like, I didn't even say anything actually disrespectful. Like, maybe some people with, um, because I, I actually did watch the video. Um, to just see, cause I was getting the comments and I was like, huh, did I actually say something that would like actually offend a, um, a YouTuber? And maybe some people would think that, uh, me saying that, um, how do I say this? Like maybe saying that someone that's Christian isn't actually like saying they aren't Christian. Maybe that would be seen as disrespectful. Um, but I don't, if like, okay, this is the thing. When you say an insult to someone, or you say a joke to someone, and the, the, um, the person, the person, okay, what am I trying to say? Okay, so when you say a joke to someone and other people that hear it are offended, you don't apologize to the other people that are offended because the joke wasn't directed towards them. The joke is literally to Corey. And the reason why I was fine with making this video is because he, when he came back to YouTube, he was laughing at a video just like this. So, you know, um, and then this dude says gloomy ghost. Oh yeah, this was the one that really made me, uh, my timbers were shivered. I got it! Or, shiver, shiver me timber, okay. Boy, if you don't- Okay, so he says, bro, shut up. No need for you saying such things because you don't know him. Okay. And um, every videos he make is pure hard dedication and entertainment. You're just talking nonsense from, from this videos. Go off somewhere where people would judge instead of supporting a person because they're just a hater. Well, you're just a hater. Every reaction he makes is entertain people. I mean, he did scream a lot. Okay, we're back. I just got it. I had to pick up a phone call because, you know, I have my own life to do. You know, YouTube isn't... YouTube and the internet isn't like my entire life. I have other stuff. <laughs> uh, reaction he makes is to entertain people. I mean, he did scream a lot, but it's for people who would join the fun as well in every game. What do you mean? What's wrong with color red? I mean, you're using it right now. And then he says MF, which that is mother freaker. Oh my God, he cursed at me. And then he says, don't watch him anymore. It's not like you cared everything about him. Oh, uh, what a hater. <laughs> nice okay so well, the reason why i said to not take everything i say too seriously is because there was some truth in that video i did i have been watching Corey since 2015 since i was in second grade eight years old Corey is my favorite youtuber i literally said this countless times in this channel and especially my past one Corey is my favorite youtuber and is obviously the inspiration this is why my setup is similar to his and the way i edit my videos is similar to his but people are judging me off of this one video, this one joke video. And instead of looking at who I am on this Lord Speed channel as a whole and scrolling back to see that I've made similar videos just like this about stupider uh, topics, they're just automatically jumping, like they're just jumping to conclusions about who I am and what I'm doing. It's literally just all a joke. And it's funny to see like comments that are so serious and people are actually getting upset. And I, like I said in my pinned comment, which I'll read soon, I'm not apologizing. <laughs> I was obviously acting like an idiot, 
And to me, that's actually a skill issue. If you if you watch that entire video and um you think I'm serious, if you watch all the videos of me with the bun up and beanies and you think I'm serious, I don't know what to say. But let's see this. Okay, so Lone Wolf, that was the first person that commented. That's when I went into the video and I saw that it was getting views and dislikes and stuff. He said, um, didn't he bring this up in his 10 million subscribers video? Who are you to judge him? And if you're so Christian, you shouldn't assume bad things about others. Practice what you preach. Yeah, talk to him, brother. Talk to him. Talk to him. You're so Christian. Practice. <laughs> you're so Christian. Wait, 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 what did he say? You're so Christian. You shouldn't assume bad things about others. Yeah, you shouldn't assume. And assume bad things about others. You know, if he if he sticks by his word of like um you know spreading the message of not judging other people, um he should like go and reply to all the other comments on this video. You know, just to be real like that. You know what I mean? Like instead of just like calling me out on like the bull that I was saying in that video, he should really like say stuff to the people that are like commenting stuff. Because people are automatically jumping the gun and saying like I'm like a bad person, I'm like a hater and stuff. But I literally, it also, if you scroll down, you could see that I've reacted to Corey S. Kenshin based videos and I didn't say anything bad in those videos. Like, if you watch those videos, you would see that I'm a fan and you would see that, that that's actually me. All you need to do is do more research before commenting and saying whatever comes first to your mind. Oh, my boy Ace watched it real talk, brother. Can you spread the word of Christ? The devil snares always finds a way. So he's just like doubling down on, uh, me being a, a Christian that's out for Corey. And I said the truth had to come out, brother. That was just a joke. Because that's that was when I... Uh, my first vibe that I wanted to do was, like, I, I did want to double down and, like, keep it as, like, keep up the character just for those videos. Like, just for those videos alone, I would uh, keep up the character that I'm just, like, this Mr. Big Brain. I'm smarter than everyone. Uh, no one has anything on me. Uh, everybody else is wrong, and I'm always right. It doesn't matter what the situation is. I kind of wanted to keep up that character. But then I decided that um, I just, I found it funny to point, I, I think it would be funny like this entire video to just make a video of me pointing out why I'm obviously an idiot and why I'm obviously joking. It's satire, it's supposed to be comical. And um, so then Roosevelt reviews, uh, bro was kind of chill about it, but bro was kind of like, I don't know, saying that I'm like trying to view farm and not acting like me. Like I literally made the videos. I know there's some people, some YouTubers like uh, Morgs or like White Boyum that are like acting like um, what they think people want from them. And that's not, I don't really care about the views. I just making this stuff for fun. Those videos are like the most fun videos that I could record because I get to just say the most outlandish stuff. And at the end of the day, it's just a joke. It's just stupid stuff. And it just, it reminds me, it reminds me of a time like when I, um, you know, hang out with friends, you just say stupid stuff that you don't, like, you don't actually believe it. It's just funny to say stupid stuff that no one believes with. I don't know how many times I could say stupid, like, God, leave, bro. But let me read this dude's comment. He said, yo, bro, what's wrong with red shirts? They just closed, bro. Don't send me hate. I'm just saying there's no way you should stop watching Corey because of a red shirt. Everybody wears a red shirt once in a while. I mean, I wear red shirts all the time because red is my favorite color, if you couldn't tell. <laughs> but Corey inspired you to start YouTube and he, and he is your favorite YouTuber so you shouldn't say said bad things about him to get views and attention. Only way you could get views is to be yourself and make good content. Corey would be proud of you for that but you said this about him and you said this about him he would not like this because of what you said in this video. I'm not trying to hate on you or anything like that. I'm just saying I hope you understand what I'm saying. It's cool that Corey inspired you to start YouTube but you can't you can't say this about him and horror games are fun and they are made for us to get scared and have fun with it and look scary so yeah once again don't send me here i'm just letting you know bro i wish nothing but the best and success for you okay so um that comment what it was kind of chill but it also felt like passive aggressive so um this is this is how i read it so i tired me saw the comment and was like uh red shirts are okay corner inspired you youtube uh, you made the video to get views, attention. You're not being yourself. Corey would be proud of you if you be, if you're just yourself. Um, yeah, no hate, bro. No hate. I just hated this video. That's basically how the vibe that I got. <laughs> like, no problem to anybody commenting this. Like, cause at the end of the day, I know these people are still gonna like. Um, they're, they're the samurai. I I already heard all this stuff of like the samurai coming at YouTubers that disrespect Corey and stuff. 
And uh, that's basically all they're seeing. They're just, they see a video saying Cornish Kenshin's evil. They take it at face value. They watch it. They don't know me at all. So then they automatically assume that I'm just like hating from Corey. And to, to them, it probably doesn't even matter if I'm being serious or joking or not. Because they may just think that um, I'm like doing this reviews. And I'm not, you know. I Corey as Kenshin was like the only, this was the only time I've ever talked about a YouTuber. And I just thought it would be funny. To me, it is still funny. Um, and it's also funny that people can't read the room, I guess it is. Um... But let me read my pinned comment. This is the last thing I'm going to do because this video is kind of long. It's just me like rambling on as to why I think this whole this whole situation is stupid. Also, nothing would ever make made me take down the video. If like Corey, for example, actually saw the video and he was like, uh, hey, I didn't find it funny. That is the only way I would apologize. Like that's the only way because that I would never apologize to someone to like for a joke that wasn't directed towards them. And there was no actual hate or like uh like negative energy in this video like actually getting directed towards him because I'm literally like sitting back like this saying Yeah so he yells and you know what else yells? Skinwalkers and skinwalkers they're demons. I think every single video, Corey is yelling to try and bring something about this world. Like, there is no way you actually believe that me, that I believe that. Like, look at me. Mr. Sexy. Okay. Hell yeah! Hell yeah! So this is my pinned comment, and this is the way, like, after filming this video, I kind of feel like this is pointless. Um, I'm still going to post this, though, because I did kind of waste my time, you know, because this video wasn't fun for me to record at all. I'm trying to make it look like I'm happy, but it, it's it's not really fun. Uh, it's not really fun for me. I just wanted to provide context for you guys um, that are crying yourself to sleep over this video. I feel like this video is about to be hated upon for no reason, Lamo. Um, Lamo, like uh, L L M A O. <laughs> you get it? Okay. <laughs> So uh, this will be the only time I do this providing context. This entire video is supposed to be comical satire. I have other videos just like this on my channel, satire exposing the truth videos. Uh, no disrespect to the people or topics, lol. Uh, this video is a direct parody of a Corey's Kenshin exposed video. I saw a while back that Corey's Kenshin directly mentioned himself. Other than that, thanks for watching the video, guys. People really can't take jokes nowadays, and also I'm not apologizing. I was really acting like an idiot in this in the video. You see, I had God grammar. God spelling and you know uh, a Lord paragraph okay <laughs> so that's how I'm gonna end the video I think that's perfect cuz that's how I kind of just I'm not responding to anyone like I responded to the one dude uh, that was saying that I was like doing this to view farm I literally said like you in the original comment took a look at the pinned comment um, but I'm not responding to any of these people because I, I don't I can't see the future and I could just see like more and more comments probably piling up coming at me. Also, I don't know what insults people come up with. They, they could call me fat or stuff and stuff. You know, I don't really care um, because the thing is on the internet, you have to have tough skin anyway. And like right before I uploaded this video, I didn't know like it was going to get like trash. I didn't think it was going to get 60 views or anything. But um, I knew that at least like one person would see it and say something. And I'm perfectly fine with that, you know. Um, when I saw the Exposed the MCs video, uh, like last year or however long ago it was, uh, I was offended by it. But then you just have to realize that some people would just do stupid stuff to either be funny or to get views. I actually do think the Exposed the MCs uh, does it for views because his entire channel is actually um, him just exposing quote unquote celebrities and YouTubers. Um, but my channel, I've been reacting, I've been playing games. I want to add more gaming videos onto this channel, but, um, I literally just put one video of me joking around about a topic that somebody already brought up, brought up in the original YouTuber, Corey S. Kenshin in this case, already laughed at and thought it was ridiculous. So, um, and it's crazy. The guy already brought it up when he, his 10 million video, he said he already, uh, he said, didn't he bring this up already? So if he brought it up already, why do you have a problem with this video? So, uh, yeah, um, play stupid games, you get stupid responses, you know, that's just me. Um, I don't know if anybody that watched the original video is actually going to watch this, uh, me explaining, 
Um, that is literally just for jokes, okay? But yeah, uh, you're never gonna see me apologizing, you know, apology with tears, wah wah. Um, I hope you got, hope to see you guys in the next one. Only way out, don't forget to strike the like button, share and subscribe. Go check out previous videos on the channel. Check the channels I'm subscribed to, and maybe I'll hit you guys with some Batman Arkham Asylum tomorrow. And, uh, yes, there will still be business suits and beanie videos. It's not about Corey. I love you, Corey. I love you, Corey. I love you, Corey. You know, I used to be your number one fan, and, uh, I think everybody else kicked me down to the bottom.